This weekend, hundreds of people will march through Kleiner Park in Meridian for March for Meals, and it raises money for Meals on Wheels. In years past, KTVB's Larry Gebert, he was such a big a part of the event, so we wanted to talk about it. And of course, joining us here is Grant Jones, the CEO locally here of Meals on Wheels. All right, let's talk about the March for Meals. What is this yeah. event? So this is a really simple event to participate in, but yet make a huge difference. So for example, no registration is required, no entry fee. You just show up, sign in, take a really grueling march, a third of a mile around <laughs> Kleiner Park. So anyone can do it. Strollers, wheelchairs, walkers, everyone can do it. And then Horizon Credit Union and the Good Feet Store will essentially pay for the cost of a meal for every marcher. So it has a huge impact and yet requires very little time and commitment by anybody on a, on a Saturday. And we're showing yeah. some of the video from years past. I'm curious, mm -hmm. do people ever dress up and you know, put, wear yeah. some wacky costumes? And Absolutely, in fact, we encourage that. Uh, Horizon Credit Union will offer their Spirit Award winner again this year. And so, yeah, the more the merrier. And yeah, we've had some pretty creative people in the past. And I imagine, you know, a ton of people, we've seen the videos from years yeah. past, a ton of people show up to this. What type of a difference is the donation made mm -hmm. for these people able to make in our community? It's really a huge difference. And not only does it mean that we receive funding, so about $5,000, but it also means that we really show, uh, we really create some awareness about food security among seniors, and that's so important. So it makes a big statement but yet in, uh, provides revenue as well. And we live in such a generous and beautiful community. And uh, mm -hmm. I see here, you know, one in six seniors in yeah. the United States, yeah. they face food insecurity. Yeah. Um, in terms of the need and in terms of how this addresses it, mm -hmm. what is this weekend setting up to look like? It just means a lot because we have about 63,000 seniors in Idaho that are food insecure. And so we serve this part of the state, but we know there are a lot of people who are food insecure. And Meals on Wheels is a proven solution to both food security but also independence, so it's a double whammy, if you will. And I know folks mm -hmm. are going to want to uh, definitely be a part of this and contribute. Mm -hmm. If you can't make it to the march this weekend, what's the best way to connect with you guys? You can certainly go on to mealsonwheels.net, metromealsonwheels.net, and donate. That would be wonderful. Uh, but we just hope you'll come out, give about a half an hour of your time on Saturday. You just show up before 1030. The short march begins at 1030, and you make a huge difference, have a huge impact. And have a little bit of fun, yeah. too, out there. All exactly. right, well, we do have to go to break, but thank you, as always, yeah, for coming you. here on the News at 4. Thank we you. will be back right after this. Mm -hmm.